Okay, let's look at installing an HDMI website. So these are the files on the memory stick that uh, include a couple of templates. Um, it's always a good idea to start with a template when you're building a site because um, it's just a lot quicker. So find a template either on oswd.org or on the memory stick and um, the first thing to do is just to copy them to your computer. So this is my desktop where I'm going to make a new folder called my website. And let's open that folder and just paste in it um, the template that's on the memory stick. Okay, I'm going to duplicate the first one so that we've got a kind of backup of the original and rename it index.html. Now, any website, the default home page is index, okay? Um, so let's, I've just opened it with nView and nView is, um, nView is this free thing much like, like Dreamweaver or, or uh, just a program to edit an HTML page without having to know too much HTML. So let's look at this. As you would in a Word document, I've just deleted a, a bunch of text and I'm going to put in welcome to my website. Um, so very simple to do. Let's look at the source. At the bottom you see that tab that I just clicked, the source. This is the HTML code behind it that makes it all work. Um, one important thing to change in this is where you can see it says insert your page title. I'm just going to change that to, um, I'll change it to my website, but you should change it to whatever is, is relevant to your site because the title is one of the most important things that um, Google looks for. Okay, so that's my, in, that's my index page done. Um, now I'm going to duplicate it again. And this is the way you should do it. Whenever you're happy with um, a web page that you've done, once you've, once you've created your home page and you're happy with it, duplicate it to create any other pages. So in this case, I'm going to call it contact.html, for example. Um, so name it whatever you want. It could be you know, events.html or, or whatever the pages you want to make. So this is, this is a duplicate of the index page. Um, as this is an example, I'm just going to change it, to change some of the information in the page uh, to contact us. And while I'm here, um, I'm just going to add a link back to the home page. Um, and this is, the, this is one of the important things with an HTML site, is you need to make sure that um, any pages you make, you need to make sure they're linked, they're linked from all the other pages in the website. Um, So let's go, this is, okay, this is back to the index page, this is the home page again, let's go back. Um, and I'm going to make a link here, so contact page, I'm going to highlight that text and hit link, and then type in contact.html. So this means that this, that, that will now link, when you click on that, that will link to the, the new contact page that I made. Um, the only other thing to do now is to drag those files across to our server. So this is FileZilla that we saw earlier, um, I've just connected to the server those. Um, okay, so click on public.html and that's your folder where your web files need to go. Okay, so I'm going to browse to my desktop and I found those files that I've just created and I'm just going to drag them from the left to the right so that remember the local files are on the left and any files you upload to the right are, um, are the, the web files. Okay, so this is, this is, okay, this is back to Hotmail. So um, this is the email I received from HostGator saying where my website is. So I'm going to click on that and there we go. Okay, those are the HTML files I've just created. Welcome to my website. That was, that was, what I, that was the change I made and I added that link to contact page. This is our contact page and on the right there I've added a link to the home page. If you look up at the top you can see the address of contact.html and if you look at the very top of the, the bar there it says my website Windows Internet Explorer. That my website bit is uh, where I've entered the title in the, in the HTML. And that's it. So um, producing an HTML website is just a case of starting off with a good template, um, hacking it up as much as you like, making it into something that's yours, and then duplicate the page as many times as you want, depending on how many pages you want in your site. And that's it.